So we got to get systems in place so that when this momentum hits, we are not scrambling and overwhelming yeah. ourselves. We have systems so that we can streamline, we can continue this duplication that's already just so beautiful in our team. And now we can also maximize our time because we want it. We're lifestyle people. We want to show the mm -hmm. best lifestyle and we want to show ways that we can work smarter and not harder. Yeah. More time for showing lifestyle, um, making every, all the systems work for us. So like I said before, we're going to show you how to reach 50 people in 20 minutes. And these things that we learned today blew our minds. We were like, oh, never even thought of them. But for like for a start, like this is how much the company is growing and the momentum that is happening right now. Last month in March, the craziest month ever, everyone was insane. We had 307 rank promotions. It's so many, like everyone is doing incredible right now. I know everyone on the call here is going for something big. And we're just saying, think even bigger. Like let's make it easier so that why can't we double rank every month? That's, I mean, Allison's going to double rank this month. That's that saying, like, we're going for this. So, yes, yeah. you have to think big stretch. Because if we start to put, um, if we have bigger ideas, we're going to, we're going to get there. I never would have thought I can double rank until someone said, yeah, you can. So it's yeah. like, we just have to have that belief and we can. So everyone go for the, for something that makes you uncomfortable. And then this is going to be some tips to yeah. use social media so that we can really maximize that. So do you want to um, sure. start? Yeah, we'll just start with a couple of notes just before, just um, to help out um, some ideas that are really good. So the first one is sharing fast start stories. So as you're growing your team, it's really important that when someone hits fast start and we help them or someone in your team helps someone else, we share that so that people realize that fast start's not that difficult. Fast start is something that we should be helping everyone hit. And even if we didn't hit fast start ourselves, we should act as though we've relaunched our business each month and hit every goal. So 10 days consultant, one month director, two months executive, we've got to do it ourselves and do it ourselves every month so that every continually, so that we're showing our team that how easy it is. And so we can duplicate it for people going down, down, down. So this is about the whole team. And when we've got our systems and our duplication in place, that is when we have a rock solid foundation under us. So everyone is running this. Yes. Yeah. Um, so sharing our fast start stories. If someone on your team hits fast start, shout it out, let the world know they did it. Like, this is incredible. The matching bonuses, then they can pass that down to their people. It's so important. And like meaningful stories. Yeah. Another way you can share that story is in um, a connect call using examples of say, you know, if someone is, sort of unsure about this business, if they can do it, say, well, I just had someone enroll who you didn't think they could do this and has hit the fast start. And you can share that story. You know, you're going to have authentic stories. And by the way, I hit fast. I didn't hit fast start. I wasn't even close, but I did it last year when I decided to lean into the business. And that was, um, I gave, I, I acted as if I relaunched completely. So at any point you could pretend you're a complete newbie, even Kim Sanders, who's been here for like, what, five years now, you know, we can always, four, three? Three. I thought you, oh, okay. Well, you were here before I was. So I just, <laughs> you're an OG. So it's just like when we have been, um, there's no, we can just restart so that we have that experience and that story to share. Look, I didn't do it when I first enrolled, but I just did it now. And I know how, how to do it. I have the blueprints. So that's why we always want to, even if we didn't hit faster, never think like it's gone, like, like you can relaunch. I did it last April mm -hmm. and in three months I hit diamond. So, um, believe me, if I could do it, you can do it. And, um, yeah, now and we have because some... of Alison's leadership that I was managed to hit. I managed to hit my fast start diamond in three months because we follow the people that are above us. You know, I couldn't have done it without her. We all come in new to this. I was like a flapping salmon. Like, I don't know anything that's got, that's a terrible analogy, but I'd never done this before. So it was literally because Alison knew so well how to do it. And I was like, open. I was like, okay. So if we can get every single one of us leaders on here to be able to do that and to pay that forward, solid. If everyone's hitting fast start, this is going to be a dream ride for everyone. It's going to be so much easier. Yeah. 
be open like Alice. That is uh, <laughs> like a just, salmon. <laughs> yeah, be <laughs> a floppy salmon. Just be open because we, if we're not open to receive the coaching and the training, it's just not going to work. Giselle, before we get into it, do you have a question uh, or your hand is up? So I just want to make sure before. Yeah, I, I think you answered it though. Um, when you said to share um, fast start success, is that publicly like on your, like on your personal Facebook page or is that like, what do you mean by sharing it? Okay, that's a really great question. Um, so there are, and I went over that really fast, but I just want to reiterate that, that there are really an amazing thing is on a connect call is to share that. So when you start having, you know, brand partners connect you with, their prospects, you can share a story of how someone in your team did it. And, you know, to, to hear someone, to hear a legitimate story from you of someone, you know, you help do, that's going to create that belief in them that they can do that too. And so that's a great place to share. You can also share it in your team, um, you know, share it within, like we have kind human tribe and we're always shouting each other out. We don't need to just shout out like, you know, uh, who got a UBT, who got, like it's like there's so many things to shout out so it's just like what like elevating the fast start earner the fast start people is a really good we want to see more and more people doing it because that creates the belief like oh if she can do it yeah. maybe i can do it you know so just sharing that sharing it even in your own personal you can say i helped someone you know you can do a live about i helped someone hit a fast start bonus they came in and made their money back before they even got their products, like, or, you know, before they even had their transformation. So we, sh we can share it so many different ways and we just need to get those stories out there for people. Mm -hmm. So, uh, so let's get down to some, you want to go straight into the skills? Yeah. So what, okay. So this was from, um, yeah, a very high level training that we had and we got some insider tips from people who are doing um, like killer like, three, like going for three, three star, star crown and um she is just flying through and she has some systems in place and we could not wait to tell you guys about it so um where was the first one it was it was the social media skill so we are our downline shortcut to success we show our downlines how to get the shortcuts we teach that to them. We don't want it to be long-winded. So when we know the shortcuts, we want to pay that for, we want to pass that down. We are their shortcut to success. Um, we teach them our secrets. We don't hide anything. It's so important that we share anything that we find out just to help the whole team, um, to ma help maximize the effort of the team. How do they keep organized systems and strategies? Um, so the learning is in the doing. So this is about a shortcut um so i don't know like put a one in the thing if like like me i thought i was so organized i've got my notes on my phone loads and loads of links loads of scripts and i copy paste i'm copy pasting all day does everyone else do that like have you got your notes already down put a one if you're already doing that sweet nice because we were like oh we already do that like yeah. this is great but then we learn there's a one up there's and and then they get overwhelming. I don't know about you, but I have tons of notes now. <laughs> and you know what? I think I'm going to go back and find them. But how much time does it take to really go back into your notes and find that perfect one you were looking for? Or, you know, like we all mean well with that, but it's not organized. It's like there's a, it's, I mean, it's hard to stay organized. Organization for me is my, that's what we need. We need organization is, is everything to set us up for success. Yeah. And this is about typing less. So what we learned today was text replacements. So a few characters you can use, you can type it into your phone, you can type it like into a, into a chat with someone and those two or three letters will open up a link to the whole text. So you're literally just abbreviating, like so for example, if you wanna send someone the link to your permalinks with the UBT attached. So instead of going into permalinks, going through it, you can literally make a code like U, B, T could be the code. And the whole link will just appear and you can send it. And we were like, what? How, how do you even do that? That's incredible. So you're using a few characters to get a whole script into a box. So this is like a cheat code. And this is like known information that we didn't even know. Um, so we're gonna show you how you can do that basically. Yeah. It's, it's available on Android and on iOS. And if you're on, um, 
it will basically go onto your laptop too. If your phone synced to your laptop, it will be the same thing. So you can be on Facebook, putting in your codes, like, yeah. And we are gonna go, and we're gonna do this tonight because we just learned this. So we just learned this a few hours ago. We have not had a chance to actually do it. No. But what we wanna do as a team is create a language with codes so that we can all have this duplication. Yeah. Um, you know, so yeah. we know that um, we have certain, even scripts that you just have a, a certain code for, um, and, you know, we believe a lot in voice mailing and voice notes. Love so it's hard for us to say that we, we don't encourage a lot of script using, but at the beginning, when you don't have your own voice here, because oftentimes I know I didn't have that enthusiasm and that energy to share about this because I just didn't have, you know, my own personal experience. Like I, I just didn't, I wasn't there yet. When you first join you don't, it's, it's, and it's all about energy. It's all about authenticity. So we are relying at the beginning on some, you know, some easy scripts. And so we want to make that something available for all, all our team when they first join. So that's something we're going to work on is doing a yeah, few we're easy make scripts. A script. So we'll yeah. send that out. So everyone can just have the same one and you don't have to like worry about it. We're just going to try and simplify that for everyone. So we'll do that. But how we can set that up. Should I just go, yes. everyone got like a pen and paper so you can write this down. It's different for iOS and it's different for Android, but we'll go into the iPhone one first. And so number one, you go into phone settings. And from there, you're gonna scroll down to where it says general. And from there, you scroll down again to where it says keyboard. And then there, there'll be an option that says um, text replacement. And then you click on the plus sign on the top right hand corner of that. And then there in the top, you type in your text, like the full text, and there's a box underneath where you'd create the link, the three two letter link. It's that simple. And it will save onto your phone. Yeah. So think of all the things that you do all the time. Like, you know, we're always using, typing our, e giving our email address. We're, so you might yeah. want to make a cheat code for that. We're always doing, giving our, you know, there's certain things you realize you're always repeating. House address. Use, start making little shortcuts for all of that. And it doesn't even have, I mean, for everything, like, right? Like even sentences you tend to use a lot, like just mm -hmm. make little short, make, make your life easier. Start making your own codes for everything that you use regularly i love it i think it's so smart and for those of you on android you might want to write this down anyway so it's similar you go on settings and then from settings you go tap language and input and then on the next screen you're going to select keyboard or samsung keyboard and then there it will say tap text shortcuts tap add and then tap add again. So a box will come up for your, whatever the link, whatever the script, whatever the words may be. And then underneath will be a box where you'll choose your code. And then we're gonna, that's what we're gonna be working on. A list of this for people because there are certain videos I use all the time. I don't know, like I have favorites. So I'm gonna use, we're gonna accumulate like our, and we could work with Kim with this as well. We're gonna accumulate, you know, lists of stuff that we use a lot as leaders. Like we've whittled it down to the stuff that we find works the best. And then obviously add in anything else that you love, anything that resonates with you, but we'll just make the core list, I think, yeah. of the stuff that we use the most yeah. to get everyone started. And so- So does everyone that, have yeah. notes on that? Is, I mean, uh, people who have their iPhones, they took notes, you, you I wanna make sure everyone, yeah. Yeah, okay. This is recorded as well. So if you have brand partners that haven't been able to make it, please let them know about this information. <laughs> it's gold. Mm -hmm. Okay, awesome. Okay. And that is how you're gonna be able to reach 50 people in 20 minutes. Three letters, three letters, three letters, three. You can see how amazingly efficient this is gonna be when you you can reach double the amount of people that you could before. So your business inevitably, going to explode so this is a very exciting thing Yay. it's going to save you a lot of time over the course of you know accumulation um we've got another hack yes okay this i love this one this great. is so easy and this is an easy way to stay organized 
So in your, I don't know if you guys have noticed in Instagram, for those of you who are using the Instagram platform, um, and there's also this on Facebook, if you see on the um, next to anyone's photo, there's a little save button. So there's like, I don't know if you see, um, there's that little flag underneath. Let me get one as well, just in case it should, because my phone's got a black background. Right okay, now. that'll show up better. Maybe. Mm -hmm. So here's Darcy, see this? this little save to connections button just here. That's the gold, it's that button because you can save pictures of people and of prospects into different categories. So the example that we were shown was nurses, nurses love to serve. So Seema was showing us a collection of hundreds of nurses that she was following as prospects and put them into a category she called like nurses. And then you could have like real estate people or um, business partners I want to work with. So you're saving them. So they're all saved there. That's your prospecting bank. And you can do it on Facebook too. Like how many times has this happened to you guys? You are, oh. you're talking to people on social media, on Facebook, on Instagram. And the conversation, what happens is we get so many messages throughout the day that they just get pushed down to the bottom. And you know what? Oftentimes, I mean, I, I feel so guilty. I feel so bad. But sometimes people are like, they, they were like wanting this and I just didn't get back to them because I'm, I just lose track of people. We have, this is a, you know, it's a good problem to have just too many people wanting this. Uh, and you tend to lose track sometimes and then they end up going with something, you know, it's, it's, it's awful when you see that they, they either went with someone else or they went to, to another company because we just didn't get back to them. So this keeps us in our, it keeps a bank of all the people we have open conversations with. Yeah. So we can keep recirculating every few days and checking in, make sure we're rotating and checking in with all of those people in this active. And I love that it's visual. It's a visual yeah. list. So a lot of us are visual learners and I, I, I can't, I don't do well with even just names written on paper. Like I need to see the, you know, the person and be remem reminded of like, you know, their essence, who they are. And you have then this beautiful visual bank of all these people. Once you have them saved, you have them in collections. And then you're able to, as Alice said, categorize all these people. So, you know, we want to be targeting our niche. Yeah. So, and we have to think of this as we're, you know, when we're developing our why and our who we are here, we're developing also our, our market, like who we're looking for. And a lot of, I mean, we have to think, you know, who need, like, who, who are the good candidates? So we've, de like, we've just, like, we know that good candidates are people who love to serve and heal people like nurses. We know that they're real estate agents because they're great connectors Business. and networkers. Yeah. We know that they're um, people who are vegan, vegan, vegans. Um, that's definitely, I know that's what attracted me. Yeah. Um, we are looking for you know, there's certain niches that you want to really, tar even if you had an illness, let's say you had an autoimmune disease or you had Lyme disease, like um, Amy or, you know, something that you've, like you, that will be your market of people that you're targeting. I'm in an eczema group because I had terrible eczema. I know Chris also had eczema. So we're looking for people who were, you know, really looking for, and we can start to make then these active um, collections of all those people that fit that, and you can find them in hashtags. You can find those people through, you know, there's different ways of targeting. You can join Facebook groups. Um, so that's a great way to, we want to really, sh you know, target a niche, a target a market. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. And someone asked how you do it on Facebook. Oh, oh Kevin, Kevin. And on Facebook, at the top of every picture, there'll be the three dots. I don't know if you can really see on my phone, I'm really sorry, but there are the three dots and you can click that and you click save post and it will prompt you to whatever collection that you're building, whatever group you want that to be in. So it's a similar thing. Oh, oh yeah, Kim is just dancing. I was like, did you have a point? No, she's just dancing. That's fine. <laughs> yeah, so this is how we're going to streamline it because guys, I when I started this, I made Excel spreadsheets and I, I, I spent hours prospects, customers, follow-ups, what date, what I last said. And like, that's how dedicated I was. But just to learn this, I was like, are you kidding me? I wasted so much time. So this is a gift. 
If you've just started, this is a gift. You don't have to do any of that. This is just how we're going to make this streamline. So we're going to teach every one of our brand partners below, below, below. This is how we're going to start doing it. So when we have that script ready as well, for the abbreviations, that's just going to go team wide. This is, this is what we're all going to be doing. Yeah. It's just going to make our lives so much easier. So mm -hmm. that's just some of the nuggets that, that we have. <laughs> yeah. So it was, you know, this call, by the way, was initiated by Kevin Luna, who he just came just on, in. right? Kevin? He's oh, going to love the, the He's going to love these nugs. Okay. So Kevin, <laughs> is just, he's in the bush. I know his connection isn't great. So I just wanted to say, I wanted to acknowledge that yeah. Kevin um, is going to be doing our social media calls. And every Friday at this time, we are just launching it with these nuggets now, but this is going to be an ongoing weekly call because we want to support you. And these are the tools, these are systems and social media is so important. It is important that we, you know, that we make it easy for everyone joining to not be scared of social media and that for, for us to have fun with it and to maximize our potential and, and of course, widen our reach because widen, widen our reach. And by the way, speaking of widen our reach, it's tonight is the cutoff, right? Is it? Yeah. It's tonight. Okay. And you need a smart order in place for those points to count as well. Because sometimes people don't have their smart order in time and they make beautiful posts and they don't count. I'm like, no. Yeah. So, so yeah. definitely. So every Friday is cut off for the week. So, um, you know, even if you didn't do your lives or your videos, you still have a few hours to do three videos. Don't worry. That is a total, like totally doable. They don't have to be big production. You just do, uh, you can do a 15 second story. And definitely we want to be talking about plastic free. It's Earth Day coming April 22nd. So be, make sure to talk about your connection to the earth and why you're in a company that aligns with, mm -hmm. you know, all of these values that has plastic free, that's going plastic free yeah. this year, our compostable packaging, um, you know, nourishing our bodies with earth, uh, with, with plant, plant medicine, medicine. <laughs> and all of these things we want to really be highlighting, especially coming up to earth day. This is our month. Um, and so make sure your videos are talking about that. This is going to be really attractive for a lot of people. I know everyone is looking for ways to do that. So make sure you do your three videos. If you haven't uh, done them already, if, if you have, definitely make sure to submit them and make sure you're on smart order so that you get those points. Um, we are going to crush it this month with these type of promotions. So Yes, Kelly, dancing in your car. I see you. <laughs> <laughs> we are. Yeah. We're we going to have... kill it. And another reminder is to um, remembering to invite, invite prospects, as many as you can, last note, to our Wednesday, is it, what are they? The oh, mega -zooms. mega zooms on Wednesdays, because we want to see not just brand partners, we want to see bringing people on there. So working on our verbiage to invite people to yes. these, we want to kind of talk on that a little bit another time, maybe just how to beautifully invite people to these, these incredible Zoom meetings that are so inspiring, my gosh. Yes, I think we're gonna to touch on this on, on Sunday's Kind Sunday. Human call um, about how to invite properly because we could do like a whole, I mean, we're, we're definitely focusing still on our whys this Sunday, but yeah. I wanna make sure that we all know how to properly invite people because it's not just enough to, for us to say, make sure everyone comes, right? You need to know how to properly invite. And we're learning this as we go. And we want to impart this information to you because actually that is where the work, that's how we streamline and we work smarter, not harder. How to properly invite people, how to properly invite people onto our mega Zooms, how to properly invite people onto the business ops, how to properly invite people into connect calls. Yes. So, yeah. or, and how to properly invite people, how to watch a video. Because just that is, there's an art to it. So we'll do some role play stuff. Yes, yeah. do that. Yeah. Yeah. Because once you hear it one time, that's it. It only took me one time. And then I was like, oh, I'll make a few tweaks. Suddenly success from 20% to like 80% success. So that's what we want to make sure everyone knows how to do. So you can, again, share that with your brand partners, make it easy for them from the get go. This is, we're, we're in streamlining organization mode. We're doing it for you guys. I'm doing spring cleaning, guys. This is spring cleaning. It's like, we need to get organized and align for this climb. Does anyone have any last minute questions? 
or comments. Cool. Oh, that's exciting. Okay, cool. It made sense to people. That's good. <laughs> yeah. And if it doesn't, no shame. Chris, you and I will work on this. I know technology could sometimes be a little, but we're going to do it. You're doing amazing. You're doing amazing. Everyone is just doing amazing. So just, um, yeah, I just want to really congratulate all of you. You're doing so incredible. Well, we're having the best month ever. And this will be, this is our time yes. to rise. This is our time to shine. Claim Don't, it, claim it and know that you're in it. Don't get to je like December and be like, oh, it all just happened around me. And now I'll stop. It's this is now, now is the time. So claim it, embody it and just bring it, bring it. Show yourself how powerful you are. <laughs> yes. Okay, so see you all Sunday. Uh, kind human tribe zoom and love you all so much love you yay have a beautiful evening <laughs> don't forget to submit widen your reach, why your reach? <laughs> <laughs> bye guys bye, -bye. Mama, can you